Welcome back here to another episode on my channel, Firm Learning. Welcome to another coffee break. As you can see, today's video is going to be a bit different. It's a Sunday here in Munich, sitting on my balcony, enjoying a nice brunch with a couple of friends. And indeed, today I'm just going to guide you through the day, and the highlight of today is going to be a meetup. The very first Firm Learning meetup is happening in a beer garden here in Munich. And if you didn't know about that, that's probably because you don't follow me on Instagram, where I do these kinds of announcements. So follow me to stay up to date for that. Uh, trust is going to be some great impressions later here today that we are going to see. Next to me, I have uh, Paul with me here today. Paul is the co-founder of Building Radar, one of my colleagues. And we recently had a couple of MBA students visiting us in Munich at our office at Building Radar. And uh, we just had a discussion with them, uh, what's like to found a business, what's like to found a startup. And actually I thought that you made a couple of very great points on, on what's that like, uh, some pointers to guide people for their decision. Would you mind just sharing your thoughts on this topic here? First, thanks Henry for the great breakfast here. It was really nice to sit here in the sun. And yeah, so basically with the students we were discussing whether it makes sense to first get some work experience in a proper company because that obviously can help you when you deal with professionals in your startup life and on the other hand it's all about i mean founding a company is all about risk taking and we were basically discussing the pros and cons of starting a business right out of university or maybe first giving it one two three years in for example management consulting because you can also learn a lot about different industries and my opinion which is obviously biased by my own experience is I would always try to do it right out of university because you basically have nothing to lose, like you are used to a very basic standard of living and um, worst case you can still just get a job after six months if your business fails. And I think that was a pretty interesting discussion. Yeah? We are done with the brunch now, our friends left. We just tidied up the apartment a little bit. We had three little kids here. So it was a little bit messy indeed, but now we have the time to film a couple of TikToks. So I recently tried to step up my TikTok game a little bit. We'll also insert the social somewhere here, check it out. Nicolas, my videographer is here as well, who will now help me with that. So let's get into it. It is so important to do that right. Make sure you follow these crucial slips. I'm going to share with you three key tips that I believe will really make the difference for you. First, you need to have strong academics. So make sure you have good GPAs, done lots of internships, and this will then help you significantly to get that done. just filmed a couple of takes at home and thought it might be a great idea to also make use of the nice scenery, the nice weather. So now we moved here to the ESA just to create a couple of additional TikToks. So let's do that right now and then afterwards we'll go to the firm learning meetup. Very excited to meet many of you there as well. How much do you save every month? Is it 10% of your annual income to build wealth in a significant What always surprises me are business students who spend the whole bachelor. So we just created a couple of additional TikToks here at Visa. Next to me is actually Nicolas, who is my videographer. So he is responsible for some of the firm learning videos that you've seen over the last months. So thanks Nicolas really for all your work. That's much appreciated. And um, yeah, so let's move back to our apartment and then let's see what we do next. Probably soon now moving to the meetup. Very much looking forward to that. So we are on our way to the meetup now, just a little pit stop at home. Very much looking forward to it. So a couple of you already texted me, you can't do it. Some others told me now they can't do it and so on. So let's see how many of you are there. If you've missed it again, these are things I announce on my Instagram. So follow me there to stay up to date. I'm here with my wife and our baby girl. By the way, we are expecting now our second child. It will come likely in November. The doctor didn't really know yet whether it was going to be a baby girl, baby boy, likely a boy. But let's see. Very excited to meet all of you. Let's see us there and all the best. So now we're here. This is the Agostina Keller. It's one of the well-known beer gardens here in Munich. This is where I invited you here for the meetup. Looking forward to that. Let's go in and let's see how many of you are here. Very, very excited to meet all of you. Uh, let's 
tell us, yeah. yeah. But um, I think the more the fun approach is just to do whatever you like, right? <laughs> Thanks for all of you joining. It's really a pleasure that all of you are here. It's really the very first time I'm doing anything comparable to this, to such a meetup. Usually maybe I get some messages from you on Instagram, on LinkedIn, or per email or whatever, and then I can text with some of you. And that's already a pleasure as well. But seeing all of you here right now today, here in the beer garden, that's really, really cool. I hope you are enjoying yourself as well, maybe getting to know some, some new people. I talked to many of you already. I think lots of very ambitious professionals or students so uh, great that I meet all of you. So how did I start from learning? Because this is something that also some of you asked me uh, now, now today. It was early 2020 and uh, I was just out of consulting. And as you all know, it, it's not a myth, right? But in consulting, you have rather long hours. So suddenly I didn't have all this work in the evenings. I had a bit more time and then I was sitting at home. I think my wife just left. But I was talking to my wife, okay, what, what do I do with all my evenings now, right? What do I do with my time? Of course, then the new position, it was not like it was a nine to five, right? But surely it wasn't like a nine to 12 or something. So lots of time in the evening. And I was already you know, starting in this trap. I was you know, watching Netflix episodes in the evening, just relaxing at home. And that's fun, of course. But I, I didn't feel like that was the end game to do that every day. And then I, I told my wife, what about starting a YouTube channel? Wouldn't that be a great idea? And then my wife told me, again, like, unfortunately she just left, but she would confirm, right? She would tell me, are you crazy, like, starting a YouTube channel? Who's doing that? Like, who's starting it? And obviously she was afraid that everybody would, would make fun of me and so on, right? And I think a lot of people also did make fun of me, like, in the first months after I started the videos. I mean, as you can imagine, right? You know, like, starting a YouTube channel, of course people talk, whatever. The more thankful I am that right now, I think the from learning, platform is a platform that brings together people. All of you are here now. It's really something that makes me super happy, super proud that all of you are here. We are enjoying this time together. So thank you for that. Let's all raise our glasses, I think, to a good afternoon. Thank you and cheers. Great that you're all here. Thanks. I mean, always best to, to ask, but... Which is also why I mean, the art has been in the offices, the office and um, after I started, it was the end of the So I hope you enjoyed all these impressions from the very first firm learning meetup. For me, it's for sure still something very special to see how many people came here to get to know my audience. It's a great pleasure. And as always, if you liked it, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Big, big thanks to all the members for checking this out. I'm going to be back next week, next Saturday with the next video. All the best to you. My name is Heinrich, releasing weekly content here on From Learning and bye bye.